Well, the rivers are on the rise, and so I just want to give you a brief outline about uh, what's going on. These numbers, by the way, I'm pretty sure will change because it's going to continue to rain. Uh, Montezuma cresting on Saturday, Terre Haute on Sunday, Tuesday in Hudsonville, Riverton Wednesday, and Vincennes on Wednesday, uh, Saturday in Spencer, Sunday in Elliston, Saturday in Newberry, and Edwardsport on Sunday. Petersburg, uh, we don't have uh, the reporting station up, so uh, that one is not uh, reporting. Uh, St. Marie cresting in, uh, Monday at 9.17. I think that's going to change uh, big time. And Friday in Lawrenceville at 28.7 feet. So we've, we've got a lot of rain out here, and this is the reason I think it's going to continue uh, to rain and why those river levels will go up. But it's important to know that if you live along rivers and streams and places that are prone to flooding, now we're getting to a time where it looks like this is going to be uh, a, a situation that's going to be continuing to develop. And of course, Storm Team 10 will continue to track that for you, but you need to be aware that the rivers and streams will be on the rise, especially low lying areas. If you find the area, you know, where the road is and the, the road, the water goes over the road, don't drive through it. Uh, here's a look at the clouds and the radar. Look at all of this rain here. We, we continue to have rain moving up out of the south. It's a good source of moisture here. 56 in Terre Haute. Pay uh, Casey has 50, Robinson 56, Vincennes 57, and Olney 52. You know, it's rainy and it's chilly, but not only that, the thing that really gets you is you step outside and you've got this wind at 12 miles an hour. Robinson 14, Paris 13, uh, Vincennes 12, Olney 14. So you have this chilly breeze going on out there. That's going to continue through the nighttime tonight. Here's a look at the Storm Team 10 future cast. Well, it doesn't look as though we're going to have uh, really any great break. Maybe a little ease up of the rain here as we get into the day tomorrow. Maybe a little more occasional showers. But even as we get into uh, Thursday night, uh, see we still have some rain in the region and rain moving in as we get into the day on Friday. So we are not finished with the rain, at least through Friday. Maybe by late in the day on Friday, we'll get the possibility of the rain becoming a little more widely spread, uh, widely scattered, and then maybe we'll dry out for the weekend. That's what we'll shoot for. Showers likely a cold northwest breeze tonight, 46 for the overnight low. Occasional showers, a cold northwest breeze tomorrow, high of 55. Scattered showers, not as breezy tomorrow night, an overnight low of 46. And the seven day forecast, well, you know, we've got a 40% chance of showers tomorrow, maybe a little more widely scattered than what they are today, but it's still going to rain. Pretty good chance of rain and a 50-50 chance of rain as we get into the day on Friday. Maybe drying out and warming up as we get into the weekend and into next week.